Hi everyone, Mrs. Comstock here with story time today. Our story is called Remarkably You. It's written by Pat Zietlow Miller, illustrated by Patrice Barton, and the publishers are HarperCollins Publishing. I chose this book because it talks about celebrating who each of us are and talking about our strengths and the things we are good at. I hope you enjoy this book as much as I do. I miss you. Remarkably, you. Remarkably, you. You might be bold, you might be loud. Leading parades, drawing a crowd. You might be timid, you might be shy, quietly watching your neighbors go by. You might be small, just one tiny sprout, learning new things when you're out and about. You might be big, practically grown, coming and going with friends on your own. No matter your volume, your age, or your size, you have the power to be a surprise. You have the know-how, you are savvy and smart. You could change the world. Are you ready to start? Don't sit on the sidelines, be part of the fray. Go after your passions a little each day. Find what needs fixing, repair what you can, then choose a new problem and do it again. Perhaps you're uncertain, not sure what to do. Just look for the moments that let you be you. Like maybe you're funny or bookish or fast, or maybe you're always decidedly Last. Perhaps you like counting or drawing all day or finding invisible dragons to slay. You have your own spirit, unparalleled flair. So rock what you've got every day, everywhere. Perhaps you wander or wonder or sing. The world needs your voice and the gifts that you bring. You can make a difference in big ways or small. You won't know how much till you give it your all. So find what you're good at, what you have to give. Then go share, share your sunshine wherever you live. You might be a helper who's first at the scene, a speller, a builder, or a jump roping queen. A swimmer who knits, a cellist who cheers, a mutt-loving cat cuddler who volunteers. You are a blessing, a promise, a prize. You're capable, caring, courageous, and wise. You might go unnoticed or shine like a star, but wherever you go and whoever you are, don't change how you act to be just like the rest. Believe in yourself and the things you do best.
So whether you're daring or careful or kind, embrace who you are and the way you're designed. Dream your own dreams, hear your own heart. You could change the world. You just have to start. Follow your path. Do what you love to do. Be completely, uniquely, remarkable you. Go out there today, everybody, and be remarkably you.